Hello, my friends. It is August 13th, 2018, and I have got four comics for you today. Three of them are on Indiegogo, my favorite platform, and one is on GoFundMe. This is Danny D from Solicitous Comics, and let's get right into it. Our first one here is on GoFundMe. I found this actually because of someone I follow on YouTube. I will link to his video. Uh, he does show more of this artist's drawings. Uh, he shows a different comic. He's doing several. Uh, his goal is 4,000. He's at 5,025. Congratulations. He's obviously surpassed his goal. Um, I do not know how long it's going to be for him to keep this up. His artwork is very interesting. Like I said, I will link to another video in the description that will show you his artwork. Uh, it goes much more into depth than in it because I guess he got to sneak peek to it as he, he is a friend of his. Uh, I do like his artwork. Uh, here's some of it. It's different. He's got, I do believe, four or five different stories he's doing. The one that caught my attention is the one that you will see in the other video if you link to it. This, I do believe, is an up-and-coming. I think he's new. Uh, let me see if I can find Alpha Dog. Uh, ah, here it is. Grim is one. Gun Ghoul is another. Tech Lore is one. And Dragon Seed. And Templar. And Outlaw Angel. He's doing quite a few of them. Templar, I do believe, is the one that they show in the other video. Very, very interesting art. All right, let's see what you can get. Okay, for $5, you get something called the Pup Level, which is a PDF of Grimm. For $10, you get the PDF of Grimm plus the 10-page Cherry Bomb Story. For 25 you will get the first two levels of the Grim number one and an ash can. It goes on and on, folks. I mean, if you want to see what's going on on his, scroll down. You've got a $50 tier. you got a $100 tier. you got a $1,000 tier if you really want to go crazy. This one is on Indiegogo, as usual. The link will be in the description. And I will link to the video which is on Just Some Guy's uh, web channel. This is a buddy of his. This is how I found this. Never even thought of searching Indiegogo for stuff like this because, as you know, I prefer Indiegogo. Or GoFundMe. I screwed that up, didn't I? Oh, well. This one, our first one on Indiegogo. This is a, another history graphic novel. Um... It's kind of weird, uh, but, you know, I, I want to promote all sorts of stuff. Just because it strikes me as strange doesn't mean that other people may not like it. This is about the culture of anarchists in the capital of Athens, Greece. And I ain't going to... I'm not even going to attempt to pronounce that. I know I'll butcher it. It's an in-demand, so I'm assuming they've already met their goal... Um, they're at 613. The art is very different. Um, it's written in two languages, English and Greek, I'm assuming, since it's in Athens. Uh, for $30, you can get a signed copy and a t-shirt. For $5, you can get a PDF of the comic book. And be careful which ones you click on, because they are in different languages. $9, you get a printed edition of the comic. $15, a signed English edition of the comic. Um, like I said, you may want to check this out. Uh, it 
it really looks like it describes a lot of violence. Um, the artwork, it's not exactly my kind of shtick, but hey, you might be into this. Uh, check it out if you're into this kind of stuff. Our next one. This one I like very much. Uh, I had the pleasure of hearing this gentleman over the weekend on one of the live chats. And uh, I thought he was really interesting. Uh, just this weekend, he's already raised $5,517. His goal is $15,000. He's got a month left on this. This is a very interesting story. It's... It's a love story between a mortal and an immortal that fights demons and other stuff. Uh, this, for lack of a better word, this is Satan Claus. I don't know what else to call him. He probably has a name, but that's what I would call him. Uh, the art is amazing in this I mean that is incredible uh, there I'm assuming I don't know but I'm assuming this is our heroine uh, there's quite the beast there uh, I'm not exactly sure who this dude is I'm not exactly sure who this dude is but he looks pretty intimidating again the artwork is awesome uh, there's our Satan Claus again. There he is again, fighting someone. Uh, I mean, look at the detail in this. This is, this is wild. And our last picture of Satan Claus. He's got our fair maiden. He's digging into her. Not real. We have one more of Satan Claus sitting on his throne. But... Like I said, this is fantasy, supernatural. Uh, when the story was described on the uh, live chat, it was really interesting. Uh, this gentleman has a very interesting imagination. Uh, he did kind of get this story from real life. All right. Let's go to what he's given away. For the perks. We've got $10 for a digital copy, $15 for a signed copy, $20 for a twin pack. Let's see, uh, I guess that's two signed copies and digital wallpaper. That's pretty cool. $50 for five copies. Again, I like when they do this because a comic book store can buy these and they can sell them. Because, to tell you the truth, this is probably how we're going to have to start helping our local comic book stores they're gonna have to start doing this on their own and hey hopefully I can be part of that and point these guys in directions that they didn't see and pick these up here we go hundred dollars for a ten pack hundred and twenty five ooh that's a lot of reading and I don't feel like doing a whole bunch of reading but you can go down you've got several tiers this looks really interesting. The artwork is amazing. And Satan Claus looks quite wild. Our last one. Eaton's Exodus. This is about a world in turmoil. Um, the art's a very interesting style. It's, I do believe, several artists drawing this comic. Um, I don't quite understand why this guy is got his feet I'm assuming up in the tree but I will flip through some of the art here we know he's a Star Wars fan uh, like I said really interesting art uh, that's pretty cool I do like the way that looks yeah, definitely a Star Wars fan. Some more of the art. A very unique style. He likes his women with hips, that's for sure. 
interesting cat woman, I guess. Interesting creature. Like I said, the artwork is very, whoa, that's a mean looking rat. I definitely wouldn't want to find that in the wall of my house. Anyway, uh, he's at $35. There's a month left. This is a brand new one. His goal's $2,000. I'll scroll down here. And like I said, this is about a world that's going through some sort of crisis. They don't, they're rather vague on it. But, I mean, if check this out. Maybe you can write them and just get more information or not. The artwork is very interesting uh, they don't show any more down here let's go to the perks what can we get for ten dollars I guess I'm assuming that's the hero maybe not quite sure but you get a drawing I guess that's kind of a tip for $15, you get a preview. For $20, you get a t-shirt. 25, excuse me. Or for 25, you get three drawings. No offense, dude, but I think you need to go look at some of these other Indiegogos. $30, you get a wooden etched coaster. Yeah. Set of four coasters. Uh, I really don't know what this is. It says comics. Uh, but, I mean, I haven't seen a comic yet. I see lots of other stuff. I'm not quite sure. Trading cards. I'm not quite sure what you're trying to do. Um, Check this out, though. I mean, I'll promote it. It's 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 in the comic section. But that is rather strange. I'm not exactly sure what uh, what he's trying to accomplish here. Well, that's our four for today uh, on the rumor mill, and I'm very happy to say, Jeff from World Class Bullshitters. I do believe is going to have his comic out within the next month. Uh, I'm not going to spoil the story. Uh, I don't know what he wants to put out there, but I have heard him talk about it on his live chat, and it sounds absolutely hilarious. Uh, I can't wait to see it. I, I probably will back it. Uh, it's one of those that, when he started explaining it, really caught my eye. All right, this is Danny D for Solicitous, Solicitous Comics. Thank you, Uncle Lee, for popping that word into my head and me picking it. Uh, I guess I can't really blame you. Uh, it is August 13th, 2018, and I will have more comics for you guys tomorrow. You guys have a great, fantastic day.